Since 1939, only five teams from New England have gone on to capture the illustrious NCAA Men's Basketball National Championship. The first came in 1947 as the Holy Cross Crusaders completed the incredible task as the lowest seed inside Madison Square Garden, defeating Navy, the City College of New York, and Oklahoma. For the Crusaders, led by head coach Alvin Doogie Julian, the battle to MSG started in another famous building. Without a home court in Worcester, Holy Cross played all of its home games some 40 miles away at the Boston Garden. In post-World War II era, basketball was begging to sweep across the Northeast, particularly in New York and Massachusetts. The team consisted of city-born players, George Kafton, Bob Cousy, Joe Mullaney, Dermy O'Connell, and Frank Oftring. On the local front, the team was led by defensive star and captain Bob Coran. Now, since the NCAA wartime rule making freshmen eligible was still in effect, Coach Julian utilized a two-team system so that each player would get time on the court. The Crusaders dropped three of their first seven games, but then went on a tear, winning 20 consecutive games, earning their first ever bid to the big dance. In the quarterfinal contest, Mullaney scored 20 points to help defeat the midshipmen 55-47. Captain's 30 points easily moved the Crusaders into the championship game with a 60-45 win over CCNY. In the winner-take-all contest, Captain shined again with 18 points to collect the most outstanding player award. It is with great pleasure that the ECAC welcomes the 1947 Holy Cross Crusaders men's basketball team into the Hall of Fame class of 2018.